was preached after Jesus rose from the grave was a woman. Mary said, He has risen. Hey, hey, hey. And He's risen. He lives in me. He lives in you. He's alive and well. God don't have a backache. He don't have a headache. Oh, my, my, my. And when we're feeling the Spirit, we feel no pain. Oh, my God, I had a dream a while back. I thought they was killing me because of the name of Jesus. And have you ever seen on TV on these westerns, they have this, like this straight thing you go through and they dip the cattle in and bring them out on the other side. We, the Christians, was going through a straight gate like that. And as you come through, they take a sword and razor blades and cut you all over. Mind up, I said, I felt no pain. And there was a man there doing that. He said, but I don't want to do this. I want to be a Christian. I said, yeah, but they'll do you like they're doing me. They'll kill you. He said, but I want to be a Christian. And he repented, Brother Sam. And he could not cut me like the other ones was doing. My God, we're going to have to die for his name. And I used to wonder, Bahasa used to wonder, Brother Bill and Worry. My God, can I stand? I love Bahasa because we will be beheaded. My God, for the testimony of God. And I know this, and I read it years ago and heard it preached years ago. But I think God that was in the, in the Bible, that's not going to happen no more. But they're dying every day, Brother Stephen. And I said, God, can I die for you? My God, can I die for my brother? My God, who the Bahasi? For to die in God is gain. Oh, but if you deny Jesus and you take the mark of the beast, if you deny Jesus and they kill you, I believe you're going to hell. Because Brother Sam, he said you must endure until the end and the same shall be saved. Mind of a hashitara bahasaya. Udara bahasaya. Maya tatata bahasitara bahaya. And I feel that Holy Ghost, Lord of Ahasaya, all over my mouth again. Read out of Ahasaya. Mind of a hashay. For the devil's a liar and the father of it. You're not crazy. I'm not crazy. And we're not going nowhere till God says, Honey, come on home. Well done. Thou good and faithful servant. Thou have been faithful over a few things. I will make you ruler over many. Because the devil had to go before God in Job Blair. Said, Have you considered your servant Job? He's a perfect and an upright man. And he said, God, let me take away the hedge. Take away the hedge from him and I'll make him curse you to your face. But he didn't know the man Job. He was a perfect and upright man. One that feareth God and extueth evil. Mind of a Hasid of a They came and told him all of his cattle, I believe, were dead. All of his animals were consumed by fire and dead. My God, he had the had ten children. Think ten children dying at one time. They came and told him oh, that all of his children were dead. My God, but Job never lost his integrity. He still loved God, Brother Jimmy. Mind of a hussy, tub of hussy, and I just can't be quiet. I'm sorry. My, if you don't want to listen, just leave, but it's a coming out. Hit up a hush on the of a hussy. And the devil went to God again. Said, yeah, but let me touch his body. Let me touch his body. And mind of a hussy. In other words, give him pain and he'll curse you to your face. God said you can, but you can't have his life. Who the Bahashi the Bahasaya? Woo! And he was cursed with bulls from the top of his head to his feet. And I get them all the time myself from diabetes. And one boy hurt so bad I cry with it. And how the Bahasaya, he didn't have a pain pill. He didn't have an antibiotic. He took an old broken piece of pottery and scraped the pus off. That's the only comfort he had. But he did not curse God. He said, though the skin worms eat this flesh. Yet, I shall see God. Yet, I shall not deny him. Who the Bahasaya and his three friends, Zodad, Bilbad, and Zopar, came to try to comfort him. And they same as told him he was sinning. Said, this has come upon you because of sin. My God, and they put him down as nothing. My God, Brother Sam, who the Bahasi taught of Bahasaya. Woo! Hey, hey, hey. And then God told Job, said, you pray for your three friends, even though they talked 
to him like he was a dog. You pray for them and I'll bless them and I'll bless you too. Gave him double what he had. Gave him, I believe, it seven more sons and three more daughters. I believe it was. But you know, God never took his wife. Even though she told him to curse God and die. Mind up a high side. In other words, she's saying, you pitiful little thing. Why don't you just go ahead and die? He even prayed there for a while to die. He said, why was I even born? But there's a reason for all things. We are here for such a time as this, sissy. He said, lady, honey, woman, you speak as a foolish woman. Shall we not serve God in the good times and not serve him in the bad times also? That she he meant that we just serve God when everything is fine. No, 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 honey. You serve him on the mountain like you said, brother. You serve him in the valley. And like you said, sometimes you feel closer in the valley because you're so dedicated. Oh, God, you're crying from your very inner being. Help me when you're on the mountain and everything's okay. You don't pray as much because everything's fine. Oh, my, my. Told her she spoke as a foolish woman. And no doubt she was heartbroken. It was her riches and cattle gone. It was her children gone too. Mind up a high sign. Her husband was suffering so. But my God, the Bible said the 